I'm Susan. I'm going to take you along on a thrift with me. This is at a Goodwill, it's about an hour and 15 minutes away from me. And I don't get to go very often. And this time, they had some nice stuff, but it not as much as they did the other two times I went. But they still had some nice stuff, and but I still felt like the prices were a little on the steeper side on a lot of it. Get, please let me have any advice, any knowledge you have of the things I should be looking for. I thrift for my own pleasure right now, but I would love to be able to think about reselling and what I should be thrifting for to do that. So if you have any advice, information, let me know. So without further ado, let's get started. I try to look for things to flip, like wooden things. and. I tried to show the prices, but for some reason my camera just wasn't focusing in. Nothing just really grabbed me. And there's lots of little whatnots, but even that was kind of sparse. I love the swan. I got a swan from my last thrift haul. this little church. I didn't get it. I don't know why I didn't get it. They had lots of angels. And I absolutely love this teapot. I considered getting it. I can't remember how much it was. I want to I think it was 7.99. I was so focused on the teapot, I missed the frog when I was there. He was kind of cute. I might have gotten him. And like I said, the shelves were pretty empty. This case caught my eye. They had beautiful iron and metallic items. I really loved them and I meant to go back and really take a second hard look at them and I did not. I got sidetracked. My husband found that. That was a beautiful candle sconce and he found another one too. But they had a lot, there it is. They had lots of beautiful stuff in that department. They have some beautiful crystal. I've got some packed away I need to get out. I absolutely fell in love with these dishes. They're gorgeous, but they were almost, well, $45.99 for the set, which may not be bad, but more than I'm willing to pay. They had lots of cute Christmas things and I have a hard time buying Christmas in the off season and I need to learn not to do that but I get focused on the season I'm in but they had some pretty things and who knows I may pick up something you can never tell unless you looked at my thumbnail <laughs> I absolutely fell in love with these bare stocking holders and I probably would have gotten them but I think they were like $7.99 a piece but they were so cute and I love this snowman 
He's so sweet. And I love that cookie jar. Such pretty things. They had some beautiful baskets. Some of them I thought were priced kind of high. Some of them were reasonable. But I just don't have anywhere to put them right now. But they are so pretty. This salad bowl is beautiful. And my haul was very, very small this time. And I did get some, some blouses and a pair of blue jeans, but I'm not gonna show those. I didn't show any of the clothes while I was thrifting. And I didn't know if you would care about that. And it was just a few blouses and a pair of blue jeans. But for the items I thrifted, had to get him. Some things just call to me. I mean, they just say, Susan, please pick me up. My husband says he didn't hear a word, but this one called to me. I just thought he was adorable. And it's just a little votive holder. But I just, I love the red bird and I love snowmen. I collect snowmen anyway. And I only got one more item. And that was this box. I thought it was cute. I'll probably paint the outside. I'll leave the inside the same. But I've been wanting like a um, first aid box. I've been wanting a box to, to keep all my, like my bandages and my first aid stuff. And I just thought this would be cute. So tell me what you think about my little short small haul. I'll try to do better next time. So, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button. Ring that bell to be notified when I upload new videos. Leave a comment. Tell me what you think. And until next time, bye y'all.